Project manager for the Downtown Nassau Partnership, Javon Moss, says that the organization has been actively redeveloping Nassau and reaching out to business organizations who can foster the type of activity that they are looking for. I think what you're going to see in the next six, six months to a year is more venues and certainly Blue has set the benchmark for what kind of um, venues can actually exist here in downtown. But you will see more and more of this kind of thing coming along where you can come down for dinner after you get off from work instead of rushing home through traffic you can sit down and have a drink or dinner here in the city. And you're going to see more and more of that as the months go on because with the infrastructure we're also expecting that a lot of businesses are going to now see the need to open the kinds of businesses that will attract more and more people back to downtown. Moss says that while the DNP is constantly reaching out to businesses to be a part of the change, they are also closely looking at the residential component of this whole equation. We see the importance of the residential component becoming a part of the city and um, we're, we're going to work on exploring how we actually bring that to fruition. Um, so as we revitalize more and more and more and more, we see that all great cities have this residential component, which we which we have elements of, but we want to certainly expand it and we're in some conversations with a couple companies and working on how we're going to get that done as well. The DNP was formed in 2009 as a joint venture of the private and public sectors to achieve a progressive redevelopment of the city of Nassau. For the Tourism Today Network, I'm Gina Seeley.